Hi guys, I hope you're all well. I have a Charlie Bear haul for you. I have several ones and they're from different places. So the first one I'm going to show you, he's quite big and I just couldn't resist him. Now this is Fang, look at him. Absolute gorgeous. So he's classed as a bear house bear. So you have different collections. You've got like your bear house, you have your plush, you have signature, then Isabel. So this is part of a bear house collection. I'm not too sure what year this was. I'm guessing it was last year, but I just couldn't resist him. How adorable. And when I was choosing the face on So Realistics Live, I they would just look so different because of how their eyes were shaped. And this was the cutest one he just called out for me, didn't you? You do, yeah. So that is him. Stunning, isn't he? Gorgeous, really chunky, cuddly. Yeah, it's adorable. It reminds me a little bit of one of the new ones that I've pre ordered, but you know, he's gorgeous. So that is Fang, and obviously, he's got a protector on. So that's the first one. So he has come in the dust bag from So Realistic. I also bought some tag covers from them as well. I think they're about £2 for a pack of five, so I've got those. So the next two bears I got from a poor store and I ordered them online and I actually got them from there because these two bears in particular were on offer and I thought it was a really good price because I've been eyeing these up for a while now. I keep seeing people share pictures of them on their shops and different things like that so I just couldn't resist. So the first one, now bear in mind they're not obviously got dust bags, they don't provide that from obviously this company but it was bagged up, boxed up nice, good sturdy box, tissue paper in there and everything. So I was impressed with that. And I have already put some tag covers on. So we have this gorgeous, stunning bear. Is this Dana? I think it's Dana. Yeah, this is Dana. I think when I was reading, it's meant to be a panda, I think. I can't remember, but you know. So you've got your little pads, feet, Look at the face. Now, obviously, because I just ordered online, you you know, from another shop, you can't actually pick your face. That's the downside of ordering from, obviously, online and things like that. If you do manage to go into certain stores, they may have more than one to choose from, but not always. But, you know, but she's absolutely stunning. Just gorgeous. When was she born? 15th of March 2023. Nice little nose, eyes, gorgeous, beautiful colours, absolutely stunning. Got this little pretty scarf and bow, absolutely gorgeous. Legs move, arms move, head moves. Yeah, so she's quite a nice size as well. But I just couldn't resist her because she's absolutely gorgeous. Pretty. Like. Yeah, so that is a Dana. So, that's the one. I didn't check Fang's birthday, but, you know, never mind. Okay, next one is stunning. Now, I've, I've liked this one for such a while. And it's so big. It was so much bigger than I thought. And again, she was on offer and it was absolute bargain. Now, this is Bay. Look at her. Absolute stunning. I just couldn't resist you, could I? No. I love her. Look at the feet as well. So you've got like this kind of furry thing, then the typical pads. See movable legs, movable arms and head. Then she's got this gorgeous bow ribbon. And then look at that show you look at it like a heart necklace she's gorgeous isn't she she needs a good brush obviously but i just couldn't resist her and she was on offer such a bargain price big ears so it's good sometimes when companies put on offers so that's i think that's just obviously down to the company itself um, if they put offers on and things so these were on offer so i just i was umming and ahhing and then i just went for it in the end and i shouldn't have really but i did so yeah that's bye so they are the 
two that I got. Then I know there's a shop local to me, which I didn't realise that it was actually there, even though I've been past it like last year and whatnot. And I didn't, I've never, I didn't know it was there. And then I found out that they do bears. And I, um, I saw on one of the face, the Facebook group that somebody said they'd been to such and such area, and you know, got a bear. And I was like, oh let me have a look so i've found they do stock charlie bears but they do a lot of stife and jelly cats and they've got a section of charlie bears not a big section and i decided on sunday to go and have a look with my daughter my daughter got a few things she wanted some jelly cats and i was obviously looking at the charlie bear section and some of the things that i got they were on offer which is why i got them here particularly there wasn't more than one face to choose but it's nice to be able to sit there hold them and see them in person so and i shouldn't have got this many but it doesn't help that my daughter was encouraging me to buy them and there's this one i spotted straight away and it is one that i have wanted now i i've been looking for him and you can't get him anywhere and this shop had him meet pampas look at him so yes this is pampas and he's a bear house lion isn't he so he's a bear house bear big lion tail when are you born 7th of april 2023 so he's obviously a gorgeous lion stunning he's one that i've wanted so yeah i some of these i think they've come out at a certain time and then i've got maybe produced at a certain time because i swear this was 2021 bear but either way it was made in 2023 so yeah absolutely stunning so that is pampas i will pop on a tag on him in a little bit let me just have a look when bay's birthday was we didn't look did we so she was born Twenty eighth of March, twenty twenty three. Okay. So yeah, let me check Fang's birthday one. I'm at it, guys. Might as well, hadn't I? I know I didn't do it with all my other collection, but you know, did it with some, didn't I? Not others. So he was born seventeenth of the twelfth, twenty twenty three. So he's quite a newer one. All right, mate. Off you go to bed again okay so then i got this beauty because this one is one that you struggle to get in places now it's a set of three so this is a blue moon and she goes with harvest moon and rose moon now i do want the other two as well because i do want the full set and this is this little chap so i've not if you if you can see this one anywhere like grab it basically so that's what i did i saw it, it wasn't too um, badly priced and i thought i'm going to grab it now you seem to be able to get harvest moon and rose moon kind of everywhere now there are two that i will get to add to my collection because they are ones that are slightly cheaper but obviously they're absolutely stunning and like little feet fluffy nice little bow and she was born or he um 5th of april 2023 so it was the only one there so i thought i'm going to get it because certain ones are really hard to get especially once they retire on or and when a new collection comes out and i think like some of them if they were out say um quarter one of last year then it's harder to get those ones now so i thought i'd pick that up and then I can get Rose Moon and Harvest Moon from So Realistic because I know they're going to be getting some more in. So, yeah. Then, I've been eyeing this dude up now for a while. Okay, so the reason why I ended up getting him from the shop I went in because they were actually on offer there as well, which I thought was a bargain, and there was only two of them. Now, these ones you can get everywhere, and it's a set of three. The third one I can't get for the life of me. I've literally contacted every store possible. Not one's got it anywhere. Now, I'd wish I'd liked it before and found it because 
it was there. So I don't know whether, you know, one of the shops is going to get one in magically or if that's kind of tough now, is it going to have to be a barely loved? I don't really know. But I'm always on my lookout for this one in particular. Now, I've spotted these and I absolutely loved it. And when I've seen it in person, I just couldn't help myself. It was gorgeous. It feels incredible. So this is Pluto. Need I say more? Look at him. So these bears are quite reasonably priced anyway. But, like I said, they were on offer. And I just, you know, it was a no-brainer, really. Absolutely stunning. And I'm telling you now, he is so, so soft. It is ridiculous. A little ribbon. So I've already popped on a tag cover. Then the other one in this group i wasn't going to get but my daughter really liked it so i got it so this is jupiter so he's like a green kind of color it's absolutely stunning so when are you born second of june 2023 what was the other one he was 14th of september 2023 so they're quite new so they were obviously later on in the year, which is why you can still get them. Now, the the other one was out the first part of last year, and that was Neptune, and he's blue. I really, really want Neptune. Like, if anyone knows of where I could get Neptune, please let me know. I think I've contacted every poor store, every other store, every stockist, and I've kind of just looked on their websites and stuff. And I wish I'd looked out a few months ago because some people still had some and now they don't, which is really annoying. But I'm going to keep looking because you never know. You never know. It might appear at some point. But yeah, these are absolutely adorable. And I'm just really dying for the full set, guys. If anyone knows where I can get Neptune, please let me know. So yeah, there you go. So that is all my newbies. And... Now, I'm kind of like, I don't really want to spend any money. Now, I didn't really want to buy all those at the shop. But, my daughter was encouraging me. And I was really like, yeah, you know, I want this. You know, do you know what I mean? And because I like them, I just kind of went with it. And I shouldn't have really. And I'll be paying myself back, you know, for a bit. So, I just, you know, work hard and all. But... I wanted them and I've got them now and I'm happy with that. I'm not looking at buying any other kind of bear. I've looked through all the ranges at the moment, um, especially ones you can get. I don't really want to get barely loved. Now, I don't mean to sound like a snob or anything like that. I, I, it's not that way. But I just feel like sometimes the barely loved ones look really scruffy. Do you know what I mean? Like they've just been dragged around by a kid and you know, some of them are saying I just don't appeal to them. Some of them look nice, but I'm always a bit funny. I'd about i like newness do you know what i mean and i know that sounds probably does sound stuck up but i don't know what it is it's just plus you just don't know do you somebody had it around animals smoke you just don't know do you on things and that's why i try you know to just go for new and from shops um you know what i mean but i just know that they've been looked after then as well and I don't know, I just, it's, I like looking at the barely, like, barely loved or, like, pre-loved because it's nice to see how much they're selling for as well and if people have actually made any profit on them or not because I'm quite interested to know. But obviously, if you're going to make money on them, it's going to be more likely the rarer ones or the limited edition ones and different things like that, um, you know, but you... I'm not buying bears looking at it as a business or a profit maker. There's potential of it being there, but you just don't know, do you? And obviously, the more they're looked after, the more chance of you getting some money. And it's one of those, isn't it, though? Like, look at Neptune, for example. I want him, I can't get him. So if somebody had him and then sold him on, they could sell him potentially for 50 quid more, and then I'd want to buy it because I want the full set. So that's where the money comes into it. Do you know what I mean? It depends what people are willing to pay as well. So you've got to look at that kind of thing. But, you know, there's some that I prefer over others. Some that I'm just absolutely in love with. Some of them I love, but I'm not like dying love. Like, for example, 
like blue moon i wouldn't look at this and think oh my god it's the best bear i'm absolutely in love with it do you know what i mean because it's not like that but i just think they're really elegant and really nice and i just want the set of them and the blue one i think is stunning and then harvest moon is also my favorite i'm not too keen on rose moon but as it's a set you need oh, i need to have it really but like i say then there's somebody that could be looking at them thinking oh i wish i had the whole set me i could go all right well i could sell you the full set for such and such add a bit of profit on i get my money back and some profit do you know what i mean but obviously i'm not in the process of looking at doing any of that yet but you know you just got to keep your options open thoughts open and different things like that so yeah they're my bears i'm not planning on buying anything else at the moment I, obviously i am skint but and I do owe myself money back. But I'm waiting for the new lot to come in now because they could start being released at any time. And I've literally done a spreadsheet and I've said where I'm getting it from, what quarter it's coming out, how much it is, and what bear it is. That's what I've done. And I've done my husband's have done me all this spreadsheet up for me and kind of worked everything out. I've managed to cut a lot of it off again i've managed to shrink it down and then i did it another time because otherwise you're just going to get to that point is you just want every single one of them and it's just not possible and then sometimes as well when you actually see the one it's like oh well actually it's not as good as or nice as i thought it was because i was looking at some of the bears in that shop for example and i was like oh well that doesn't look as all right as i thought it was and i mean it could just be that in particular one that the styles you know that particular one didn't look good maybe the face if it was somewhere else would look better but i just mean overall like there was one of them Lindsay. it looked stunning on the shelf and i got it down and i was just like well actually it's not that amazing is it but online it was like oh wow do you know what i mean so it's one of those kind of things some definitely do look more appealing than others some look better in person um, and again the size doesn't always equate to actually what it looks like so obviously i'm saving my money to get all the new ones so i've pre-ordered quite a few still when it comes to it will i actually go ahead with them i don't know so the ones that charlie bears you can pre-order and you don't need to pay a deposit now the ones that the other companies i have paid a deposit so obviously if i don't go ahead with it i'll lose my 10 pound deposit but if i do go ahead with it I, that comes off my total so it's just one of those things at the moment the ones i've selected i've tried to make sure there's not too many in each category the annoying thing is there's so many in quarter three and i had to try and scrimp it down so what i will do i will do a separate video if you would like and i can go over the ones that i want to have what i've pre-ordered and what i want to have and things like that it's just one of those things isn't it it's like i just said to my husband i was like bloody hell i couldn't do this forever it's not feasible and there's no space kind of thing and then i'm a bit stressed thinking god when the new ones come out next year i'm gonna want all them as well and i'm just like you know being the present and all so you know i'm just enjoying this journey guys and i hope you're enjoying being on this journey with me so yeah it's really exciting all the new ones to come if you haven't seen them yet guys go over to charlie bear's youtube channel and they did a launch i think it was on the 11th of march you can watch a video they've um, done a video i think it was yesterday on all the new range coming out of the bear and me and and that explained about the cuddle cubs which i have all the cuddle cubs now there's 12 of them but they did announce on that episode yesterday that there's going to be a several more cuddle cubs coming out later on in the year so me being me i'm going to have to have more because i just want them to match with the bear and me range i wouldn't say i'd be going out and buying all those some of them are quite expensive and i'm talking expensive 24 quid just for like a little bear kind of thing um and they remind me of just kind of they remind me a bit more like jelly cats i think and they're just like you what bears you would find cheap bears probably elsewhere i mean they look really nice i like a couple of them so i might get a couple of them i don't know yet but my daughter likes a few as well so she might have some so yeah that is that on the newness make sure you do check out charlie bears guys um if you are interested and as always if you do purchase from charlie bears if you could email them if you wish just to say that you heard about them via me and my videos etc that would be really great it would show the 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 brand the company that like that i love the 
their work, you know, loves the bears, and you know, and it could down the line open up opportunities for me, guys. So I'd really appreciate if you just send an email over or something like that. That'd be really good. So that will be awesome thank you so much guys when the new ones start to arrive as well i will do obviously a video now basically they come out quarterly but it doesn't mean they're all going to be out at the exact same time so for example i think they've just started to release some in certain stores so for example one bear might be out but it might be saying one store but where i've pre-ordered it it hasn't come out yet and then it might be like that will come out then a few weeks later i'd get another one to so be dribs and drabs i'm guessing which is much better financially um so yeah but i have ordered a shelf well it's actually a cabinet so i've ordered a gorgeous cabinet for my bedroom i didn't know what to you know get i was looking around for ages and then i thought i need to have something with doors on it because max my, my puppy well i say puppy is one now he loves bears and he will just pinch them and trash them and then obviously if he goes right down to the bottom shelves he's just going to trash them all and because he's tall and can jump up it'd just be a nightmare and then I thought I didn't want loads of shelves up on my wall and then I wanted this other shelving piece but it was just so expensive so I found one it was on offer so it was slightly a bit cheaper I got it from Ikea um still quite expensive but you know I measured it up and it fits the gap in my room perfectly so it's white framed but it's got glass in it it's got lights in it and it's obviously got your doors and i've measured it all up and it seems to have a good size to fit them in so it need be i can just squish them in a little bit can't i and i can put some on top and stuff like that i just thought i'd start with a one little cabinet out the way you know and because it's glass you know it's, it's all in there it's you don't have to worry about animal dust and all that kind of stuff you know and i can just take them out brush them and then clean down the side and stuff like that when you know every so often but when that is all set up guys i will show you and you know if i end up needing some more storage i might just buy another one of those again and put it the other side so i've got my dressing table there's one there i can just put another one there as well just to match i think that's what i might end up having to do and then just the other stuff that's in my room at the moment move it down slightly that's what i'm thinking but i want to start with the one cabinet first and if i like it then i'm going to get obviously another one because I'm not too sure how many it will fit in and if it will look a mess and when the new ones start coming do you know what I mean so if I'm happy with it I'll buy the exact same one again and opposite but obviously I'll need to wait and see how I get on but once it's all set up guys I will show you that anyway I will do a little video even if it's like a short or something like that I will do one so yeah thank you so much for watching guys please give this video a thumbs up leave me a comment or an emoji and don't forget to hit the subscribe button you take care now bye bye